because beans to have the clinical tips as a doctor work I like you to before you start you should know the request of the clinician what the clinician needs for that patient usually in varicose veins of lower limb we are searching for what reflux and urine reflux yeah, and very important perforators huh what else so that you feel losing your time and more efforts are lost without taking that message. Our message in varicose veins, we should answer some questions so that arrange your technique according to the clinical message. It is varicose veins. It is completely different than DVD. Mm -hmm. But in varicose veins, before you start, you should execute DVD. This is number one. Yeah. Any varicose veins, patient coming to you, number one, exclude the DVD. Venous, no, 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 venous thrombosis, mm -hmm. not only DVT. Mm -hmm. Is there is any DVT or is there is any superficial venous thrombosis? Mm -hmm. But number one, in your report or in your worksheet, you should exclude venous thrombosis. This is number one. What second point, which is search for incompetence. Means what? Incompetence at any level, at suffering from junction, the most common, the most important. I guess Number one, suffering from junction. Then suffering from junction. Okay. Then all of the perforators. Mm -hmm. And we will describe for you simply. It is above knee, below knee, above eye. And may sometimes I give, I can add mid leg. On the medial aspect of the leg, and this is the systematic perforators, which can be seen normally, mm. but not reflexive. Okay? The number one, exclude venous thrombosis. Number two, search for incompetence. Okay? Who is? Suffering from rub, suffering from retail, and perforators, mm. which are systematic. Number four is to search for, ah, for region of interest or lateral system, which is not in the systematic way, the systematic way of the varicose, which may be here, mm. maybe here, maybe here, maybe another way, another situation, another location, other than this regular ones. This is an item, you should search for it. And you will know this only when you see the clinical situation. You should have a look to the patient before you start. Where are the major region of interest? He is coming to it. Maybe coming to spider veins mm. only. Mm. Don't lose your time. Sure. You can finish this, and you, you will check what I will tell you. After that, never to forget, never to forget, incompetence where in the deep system. Okay, you see all these items before you start. You should remind your mind by this item. First, exclude venous thrombosis. Mm. Second, search for incompetence where at the suffering femoral junction at the suffering of junction, at the regular location of the perforatus on the medial aspect, above knee, below knee, mid leg, above ankle. Okay? Then go to the region of interest of the patient. Okay? Then check the incompetence within the deep system. All of these items, if it is in your mind before you start, this will make you more effective. You will lose a little time, no more long time. You will be what? Quick as reason, okay? Mm -hmm. If you need to check that incompetence, here or here or there, I will go to the side of perforators which is making effort for us. First, go in the standard location of perforators. After this, you can pick any perforator. So, mm -hmm. this is a perforator. Mm -hmm. What you should search for? Number one, is it thrombosed or not? Mm -hmm. Number two, the location, we know the location and like this. Number three, refluxing or not. This is important because the clinician will not feel reflux, mm -hmm. but he can feel the perforator. He can uh, uh, examine the patient by his hand, and if you like to examine, examine the patient. Check, you will see area of defect in the fascia. Mm -hmm. Go to this area, you will see, you will see the, 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 the perforator. What is the main rule of the sonographer or the doctor radiologist is to check, is it thrombosed or not? Is it reflexing or not? 
the diameter of 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 preparator you can add this okay and the complication of that sometimes you may see one preparator here and the ulcer is down you should check this preparator is related to the ulcer or not okay this is in advanced cases but remember that if you have a patient for varicose veins and you systematize systematize your way of work about these points and these points will be your report answer these un uh, questions in the report but this way you will be effective and you will not lose time mm. never to forget your body belt and your uh, location and situation never to forget that the chain of the ultrasound is very important mm -hmm. we have criteria i told the in one video on youtube chair before uh, doing the exam before no chair before buying a machine mm -hmm. look to the chair first of course you guys why because your life style your body build, your health is very important so that there is a chapter named ergonomics in that book i told you to, this morning you can read this ergonomics. what about the chair chair should be what should be movable mm -hmm. should be having hand like this should have a back should be up and down Mm -hmm. Okay, because in, 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 in varicose, sometimes I let the patient to stand on his and I should go down to check that, like this. I think these are some clinical tips quickly around the varicose, and I will try, inshallah, by time to make more than one case in front of you, and this will give you the clinical tips which make you confident. Accurate. Huh?